the members of the Norfolk and Western Railway Historical Society gathered in Pikeville over the weekend for the Society's annual convention, the first time it's ever been held in Pikeville. And although railroading was the theme of the convention, the event was more like a reunion for longtime friends and fans of railroading of yesteryear. The majority of the people who came to the conventions here have been to conventions in the past, and it's uh, almost kind of like a family reunion getting back together and everybody uh, having fellowship and exchanging ideas and, and pictures and photographs and drawings and, and uh, just talking about the history and learning more about the history of the, the railroad in this area. Pikeville resident and former NNW railroader Jeff Hensley was an important part of bringing the convention to Pikeville. Hensley said the convention, which included tours of railroad yards, coal mines, and an active coke plant in Virginia, was a great success. Our attendees said that this, this place uh, this hotel and the and the accommodations of the people would something that they would expect in a large town. It's so nice. But then they, they say it's got the good country atmosphere too with, with the country people and just how nice the local people have treated them. So that's how that's how the convention wound up here in Pikeville. It's been a success. Uh, several people say it's one of the best that they've been to. Saturday's banquet at the Hilton Garden Inn in Pikeville also included a photo slideshow and a model train judging contest. At the center of the event was the love of a railroad that has faded into history, but one which now brings train buffs of all ages together. NW's gone, Southern's gone. I just want to say thanks for being a part of my life. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Reporting in Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.